So what I will be reacting to today in total awkwardness because I don't know how to talk to a camera. I really wish there was an audience in front of me because it would make it so much easier. So much easier. It's kind of awkward with nobody here. However, we are gonna go ahead and look at people who lied on the internet and got exposed for it. I think it's gonna be a little spicy. All right, first, Liar. Just told my boss to f walked out. He was harassing one of the girl employees and I had to pull her out of harm's way to comfort him. So he fired me right then and there. Okay, I think that's supposed to say comfort her. The words are just a little, they're mixing me up a little. I just wanted to get the truth out there before this whole started spreading his lies. Comment one, response. Looks like there's a few responses here, so I'm just going to read them in order. You might want to let HR know about this. You and your girl might have a nice lawsuit on your hands if they don't fire him. Seriously? Dude, he fired you because you were late again. <laughs> Leave it to a friend to call you out. Oh my god. You f cried. We're tired of your shit, man. You never check the bathrooms, you never clean your workstation, and you always blame others for fuck-ups. You knew there was a delivery this morning? You knew blank <laughs> and I needed your help and you were still 45 minutes late. We were 20 minutes late opening up because of you and we had some pretty pissed off customers because of it. It's unbelievable you would pull after blank gave you a written warning yesterday. <laughs> yesterday. I didn't want to embarrass you but I can't believe you're pulling this bullshit you're lazy and we're tired of cleaning up after you. Stop blaming others. Own up to your mistakes and quit being a bitch about it. Damn. <laughs> you always have one of these people at work. I swear to God, where I work, you guys, oh, nobody would want to work there because it is just awful. I won't say where I work, but just know, if you work there, you're going through hell. You go into Satan's butthole. It's just awful. Subject number two. You're not special for reading this, The Great Gatsby. We all went to high school. Whenever you feel like criticizing anyone, just remember that all the people in the world haven't had the advantages that you've had. Okie dokie, bleep. Let's tone it down here. I was just making a joke. So was I. That's the first line of the book. What? I didn't read the book. <laughs> I, <laughs> if you're gonna lie, make sure you have facts. Or actually, if you're gonna lie, at least, at least know something about what you're lying about. Jeez, people, <laughs> this is just awful. Like, what? 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 Subject number three. Hi, babe. What are you doing? Nothing much. I'm really tired. Just going to sleep now, babe. And you? In the club, standing behind you? Whew. I would be pretty pissed. <laughs> He'd be dead. My husband would be gone. It'd just be like a big explosion. Right up in his face. And then I would probably beat the other Just because I was pissed. This is no bueno. Treat your partner right. Next liar. These are great. Oh, that's cute. What is that? Oh, you know what that reminds me of? I think it's the sink from Teletubbies. I don't know what it was, but I remember there was an article about this that was claiming it was like the liquid meat or something. So crazy. Say hello to mechanically separated chicken. It's what all fast food chicken is made from. Things like chicken nuggets and patties. Also, the processed frozen chicken in the stores is made from it. Basically, the entire chicken is smashed and pressed through a se sieve, sieve, is that? Correct me if I'm wrong. Sieve, bones, eyes, guts, and all. It comes out looking like this. I I'm already doubting the story because I think that this is one of the stories I read. Anyway, moving on. There's more. Because it's crawling with bacteria, it will be washed with ammonia. Soaked in it, actually. Then, because it tastes gross, it will be reflavored artificially. Then, because it's weirdly pink, it will be dyed with artificial color. But hey, at least it tastes good, right? High five, America. Oh my god. 
That's 2D custard machine. <laughs> I knew it, I knew it. I remember watching an article, or not an article, reading an article on Facebook about this and they, they said the same thing, but <laughs> people come up with some wild sh like, I don't even know where some of these people get this. I wanna know what's going through these people's minds to be just like, I'm just gonna go ahead and barf up some it and just say whatever I want and not have any facts. I wonder what it tastes like. Tubby custard. I like custard. I like custard. My favorite donuts are custard. Next, liar. There's no better way to get in shape than to prepare for a triathlon. This guy tells ya. <laughs> Rich Froney. I'm that guy and no, I won't tell you that. <laughs> imagine being called out by the person. Just imagine it for a second. I would feel completely embarrassed. I mean, like, oh God. Oh God, I wonder I wonder what was going through that person's mind when they saw this post. Like they're just like, oh shit, he he actually he actually came back and said something. Next liar. The hurrier I go, the behinder I get. I drew this. Hmm, that's a pretty good drawing, actually. Let's read on. Oh. So you know it's kind of shitty that people do this because I am also an artist. You guys will probably see some of my work eventually. I don't know when, but I will post something sometime. Or I'll do like one of those show things or whatever, and then you guys can see it yourself. But why, why do people have to lie about this stuff? I really don't understand. Like, I do like get it, you wanna seem talented, but what if somebody was like, hey, can you draw me a picture? I just saw it on your Facebook. Oh my God, let's, <laughs> please draw my face. Please draw my face. That's what it always be like though. Next, liar. My boyfriend made a promise to be that we would visit Paris and lock a padlock to this very bridge. Throw away the key, a symbolic gesture of our love and commitment. He is my soul, my life, my reason for fighting. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no, 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 no. That's Australia. <laughs> okay, again, if you're gonna lie, you should probably know what you're talking about. Even I know, that's Australia. You can see the amphitheater in the back. What is that, Sydney? It's definitely not Paris, otherwise you would have the Eiffel Tower. <laughs> Next liar! Scared to death, someone's trying to break in. Wink, wink. <laughs> Call the police. Someone trying to break in. Oh, need to update my status, lol. Instead of writing this, calling the police might be a smarter choice. I can't get to my phone. You wrote this on mobile. <laughs> People, you got to lie good. I mean, like, what the hell? It says right there, four minutes ago, via mobile. Like, it always, it always amazes me. The length that people will go to get attention is kind of, it's kind of horrifying. I don't, I don't know if it's any good. Like, I don't know if that's a good way to be. You shouldn't want attention so much that you're willing to lie on the internet for attention from people you don't even know. Well, actually, I think this is Facebook, so maybe she might know some of these people. Which I feel unfortunate that uh, her friends be like that. Next, Laya. After a week of hard work, I finally have a six pack. Skin is off color due to hard hours put in daily. It hurts, but it's worth it. Hope I can keep it and color heals up soon. <laughs> Teach me Photoshop, please. Haha, <laughs> it's not Photoshop, but legit. Okay, first of all, look at, look at this. It's like a, I don't know, what is that? Like a, it's a really weird color. And then there's his skin. Obviously, there, obviously those aren't his abs. Come on, that's, that's just so, that's so weird. I guess at a glance, you might be like, yeah, yeah, that's his abs, but no, no. I guess you gotta be scrolling really fast because even I'm like... Mm -mm. I'm not falling for it, buddy. Not falling for it. Next! Next liar! Next liar! Here we go. Just got back from Colorado, had an amazing trip, and shredded the mountains every day. Attempted my first egg flip, 
didn't land it, but the pick my buddy took still looks amazing. Can't wait to go back. <laughs> That photo is from a 2012 calendar and is literally the first photo on Google image search so full of <laughs> So, I mean like, <laughs> there is Google image search. Like you can literally download the photo and then image search. I don't know why, but some people just love calling out liars because that's a lot of work. It's a lot of work. I. I mean, like, he probably f me now, right? <laughs> like, damn, maybe I shouldn't have lied because I'm gonna call him out. Is stop lying. Just stop it. Don't do it. Don't let. Let's not. Let's not lie no more. Next liar. Oh my god. Okay, so funny story about this picture is there was somebody on my feed who posted this when they called out sick from work, and I was like. I was like genuinely worried. And then I was like, uh, where did I see this picture before? And I was like, oh, well, here's the picture. Somebody posted this before. And then they took it down because I think the same thing happened is someone called it out. So I'm not gonna go over this one because I've already seen this one. So let's go to the next liar. Next liar. A cancer. She smiled despite her illness. Like if you think she is beautiful. I don't have cancer. Stop using this image to get likes. I mean, what? <laughs> Called out by the person? Like, like, what? <laughs> Dude, these liars are on a whole nother level. Like, what? Like, why though? Why, why the need to lie like that? I'm telling you what, these... <laughs> These people are on some next because I I want whatever they're having. I want whatever they be smoking, whatever they be snorting because damn. Next liar. Time Magazine's definition of perfect body in 1955. Except Ario Giovanni was born in 77, but yes, beautiful curves. <laughs> Again, study, a little study, a little research. If you don't know what you're talking about, don't put text on it. It makes you look stupid when you're called out, yes. Yes. Next, liar. <laughs> Christmas isn't about overpriced gifts and bragging rights to what you bought for who. It's about being a good person and helping out your fellow person. Don't lose sight of real deal. And then it's a receipt. Looks like she left like a hundred dollar tip. And then there's a comment that says, make sure you put that on the copy the server takes. You wrote that on the guest copy. Oh God. So not only are you a shitty person, you're a liar. Well, I guess I, I mean like she couldn't be a liar. She could have, I, I wrote on the guest receipt a few times. So I mean, could be a liar, could not be a liar, but it's looking like she a liar. <laughs> Next liar. Sun was in my eyes, LOL, but my new favorite picture. If the sun was in your eyes, then why is your shadow in front of you? You see your shadow when it's sunny outside, stay in school. <laughs> <laughs> if the sun was in front of you, your shadow would be behind you. Oh my god. Why do people do this? Why? I don't understand. I don't even know what accent I'm doing. I just... This is what happens when you're in my world. And you will love it. You will love it and you will love me. <laughs> Next, Laya. And this is the last one. Because I am tired of all the lies. Actually, I'm kind of living for it, but I mean, kind of like when liars get exposed. All right, last one. Music is pumping, drinks are flowing, and I guess I'm looking fine since I've been getting the VIP treatment since I walked through the door. Too bad for the other girls still trying to get through. Ha, you were right. This club is dope. Why didn't you invite me? I would have loved to go. What the? You've been in your PJs drinking Natty Ice and watching Modern Family in bed for hours. <laughs> we just had a conversation about toilet paper. We're f***ing dreaming? <laughs> See? 
it. What? What's the point? If you're gonna get called out by your friends, what is the point? I guess they just wanted to look like they were having fun or look like they're having a good time. But I mean, like, social media is a lot of fake life. I don't know if you guys see this, but it's like, it's so fake. I mean, like, sometimes I'll post pictures and I'll be out there, like, posting a picture for, like, an hour. And it's not fun because it's going on Facebook and I need people to know that my life is amazing, although it took 50 shots to get the one damn picture so that way it looks amazing on my feed. But in reality, I took 50 shots and I am exhausted from one selfie. All right, guys, that was it. Thank you for joining me today. I really appreciate it. And hopefully I get better on camera soon because uh, I don't want to be like too awkward with you guys. But if you guys found it funny, leave a comment below. And I mean, like, you can go ahead and follow me on Instagram. I just made my Instagram, which is The Dane Show which I linked below. And if you follow me, you can send me messages of stuff that you would like me to react to. And I will go ahead and look at them and I will go ahead and react accordingly. And probably put your name on there. So that way I can be like, I'm gonna react to this one that this person sent me. Anyway, goodbye everybody. Subscribe.